Alrighty, next up would be what is Node.js because I keep talking about Node.js, but what is actually Node.js? So what we learned before on our uh, vanilla JavaScript course was that Node.js uh, was a JavaScript lives in the browser, sorry. So if I come here and I inspect this, I can just do stuff here on the browser. I can say console log and something. And that's going to work because JavaScript lives on the browser. Now, what Node.js does is that Node.js takes out JavaScript from the browser and gives it to the user so he can run it on his computer outside of the browser. So this means basically JavaScript outside of the browser. That is what Node.js is. It's just JavaScript outside of the browser. This means that we can do stuff in our file system. This means that we can use JavaScript to, for example, create a server, which is what we're going to do. We can also use JavaScript to make a web scrapper to go to some page and get some information because JavaScript is just a programming language. And now that we have taken him out of the browser, we can use it for um, doing stuff that is not related to the browser. That's basically it. We are going to use JavaScript to do stuff that is not browser related. Okay, so that is Node.js. It's very, very simple. It's just JavaScript outside of the browser. It's an open source thing, I think. Maybe it's not. I don't know. Node.js Foundation, Linux Foundation. I don't know if it's open source. We will see. Um, that's all Node.js is. Okay, so for example, I'm going to show you real quick. If I come here and I do console log what I did before, it's going to say something. Now, when I have it installed on my terminal, I can use easily do node and I can do console log hello and it will do the same thing here hello and undefined as you can see it's the same JavaScript can I do alert maybe not alert sorry no it doesn't work because it's on the browser do you go there you see alert is only on the browser awesome so as you can see, it's just JavaScript outside of the browser and we can just use it on our console. And this gives us so many possibilities because thanks to this is why we can use now Node to make mobile applications on why we can use Node to make uh, electron applications because we don't need a browser anymore to use JavaScript. And that is unbelievable that we don't need a browser anymore. Usually JavaScript was made to do to be on the browser it was designed to be on the browser and it wasn't designed to be a multi-purpose language it was only designed to be a language for the browser now this has changed completely and now we can use it on our console so the possibilities are endless now all right so that is node.js see you on the next one bye bye